So basically in a way this is kind of a tease the rest is up on my Instagram because YouTube don't like me posting smut even if I restrict it. So enjoy. What? Two weeks. Sero whined walking from the kitchen to the living room area. Todoroki's eyes followed the black-haired boy's movements as he slumped down on the couch next to him. I wouldn't go if I had a choice, but it's for my sister. Sero sighed, laying on his stomach wrapping his arms around Todoroki's waist as his head rested in Todoroki's lap. Sero closed his eyes letting Todoroki's fingers play with strands of his hair. He turned his head, eyes falling on Todoroki's white shirt and he smiled to himself. He brought his hand up resting it on Todoroki's thigh. Todoroki took his focus off TV for a second. Sero looked up at Todoroki's smile still painted on his lips. Sero waited for Todoroki to avert his gaze back to the TV. He let his fingers walk across the waistband of Todoroki's pants. He looked up to see Todoroki's eyes still focused on the TV screen. He huffed a sly giggle letting his fingers run up under Todoroki's shirt. Todoroki shivered at the feeling of Sero's fingers run along his warm skin. Panther? Todoroki asked, full of curiosity. M.M. Sero hummed looking up through strands of his hair meeting Todoroki's questioning eyes. What are you doing? Sero let his fingers wander. He shifted his body off the couch kneeling in front of Todoroki whose eyes quickly widened. Sero did not respond he let his hand slowly slide up Todoroki's thighs moving the fabric of his shorts revealing more of Todoroki's bare skin. Sero let his fingers lightly squeeze at the softness. Todoroki felt the heat rise to his cheeks as he watched Sero's hands massage his thighs. Am I not allowed to give my boyfriend a little massage before he leaves me for two whole weeks? What if someone walks in? MMM. Good point. I guess we will have to come up with a good cover story. Sero's tongue licked at Todoroki's inner thigh before placing his lips on the soft skin leaving a small kiss. Todoroki covered his mouth with a hand as Sero continued to kiss all over his thighs. H. Hanta you can't do this out here. Shh, no one is going to come down here. It's the weekend. Plus do you really want me to stop? Sero spoke in a reassuring tone, before sounding almost humorous when he asked Todoroki the question he already knew the answer to. Sero enjoyed giving head as much as he enjoyed receiving it considering that's the only thing they had done so far. The thoughts of someone walking and catching them sent a rush surging through his blood. Todoroki looked behind the couch scanning the stairs hoping no one was on their way down. His heart beating rapidly in his chest as he felt Sero's left hand trail up his left inner thigh while leaving kisses all over his right. He grabbed Sero's hair lightly, pulling his gaze up to his. Sero's cheeks were a light pink. A smirk painted on his mouth as he saw the look on Todoroki's face. I should tape you down so you don't try to run off right? Todoroki's eye widened his face burning a bright red. His hand gripped tighter in Sero's hair. Sero sucked in a breath at the feeling of his hair being grabbed between Todoroki's fingers. Do you like that idea? Sero hummed in a low voice to Dorky let his head fall back against the headrest of the couch his hair falling back out of his face as he closed his eyes. Roki, answer me so I know. Sero tried to suppress his grin already knowing by Todoroki's reaction he was enjoying this as much as he was. Todoroki lifted his head nodding to Sero he found himself biting his lower lip as Sero's fingers teasingly slow pulled the elastic band down Todoroki lifted his hips only to immediately drop them as his heart sank to his stomach at the sound of footsteps running down the stairs. Sero shot up from the floor throwing a couch cushion over his lap Todoroki doing the same. Mina and Kirishima walked into the living room area looking over at the two boys sitting with their backs straight. White and blue cushion resting over their laps along with their hands. They didn't take their eyes off the TV. Kirishima cleared his throat. Sero looked over at the red-haired boy. Kiri, what's up? He gave Kirishima a look that caught Mina's attention. What's going on here? MMM nothing, just watching TV Mina. Todoroki smiled softly looking up at Mina she crossed her arms raising an eyebrow. Kirishima cleared his throat again he grabbed Mina's arm pulling her from the room. What? Pretty sure we interrupted something. Kirishima let out an awkward giggle as they walked back up the stairs. Shit, 
That was Clo. Sero's words were cut off by Todoroki roughly kissing him. He fell back against the couch Todoroki straddling his lap Sero pulled back catching his breath he looked shocked. He felt shocked out of all the times they made out Sero was always the one to initiate things Todoroki was always slow at catching his hints. Roki. Sero spoke breathlessly. Todoroki tilted his head, his hair falling to the side along with strands falling in his face. Did I do something wrong? What? No no, it's just, this is the first time you've made a bold move. Todoroki looked away blushing. He stood only for Sero to pull him back down with both hands on his waist. Where do you think you're going? Todoroki wrapped his arms around Sero's shoulders he leant in kissing Sero's cheek Sero felt Todoroki's hot breath along with a shaky voice travel through his ear. My room. Sero stood up from the couch. Todoroki's arms and legs wrapped around Sero instantly keeping him in place he huffed out a surprised noise as Sero began walking up the stairs while he clung to him. Sero I can walk. I am aware. Sero snickered. He reached his dorm room stopping in front of his door twisting the knob he pushed his back against it the door slammed as his and Todoroki's weight slammed it shut. Sero let Todoroki slide off him. He stood there admiring the innocent look in his boyfriend's eyes. He pulled Todoroki closer by grabbing his wrist Todoroki placed his arms back around Sero's shoulders letting Sero pull him in closer by his waist. Sero admired Todoroki's face up close for a few seconds until Todoroki closed the space between their lips. Their lips moved slowly feeling the moment. Todoroki pulled away from Sero's lips who tried to chase after more. Todoroki smiled at Sero as he opened his eyes, throwing a confused look at Roki. What's the matter? I thought I said my room. Yes, but you see. Sero moved in closer to Todoroki, their lips inches away from each other's and Todoroki eyes moved from each other's lips to their eyes. I want you to be as close to me until the morning you leave. Todoroki felt his breath hitch as Sero picked him up again, his back meeting the soft mattress, his hair spreading out around him as Sero hovered above his body. Sero? Yeah? See can we, maybe. Todoroki spoke softly trying to form the right words to his question before embarrassingly bringing a hand to his face turning his head away from Sero. It took Sero a few moments to register what Todoroki was asking his eyes shot wide he leant back on Todoroki's thighs clearing his throat grabbing the hand hiding Todoroki's crimson colored face. Pulling it away Todoroki meets Sero's still slightly shocked look. Are you asking to? Sero spoke with uncertainty not knowing if he was right not wanting to assume anything. Yes. Sero let out a little giggle. Just to be sure we are talking about-